Yeah, it should be it should be a little bit warmer, but that's later this afternoon. This morning, it's still cool and it's still pretty foggy across a lot of the Omaha Metro, especially from downtown toward Bellevue and over into Council Bluffs. The western half of the Metro just fine, maybe a little haze in spots, but especially in Council Bluffs across a lot of western Iowa with the low visibilities and temperatures near freezing. There could be some isolated slick spots on bridges and overpasses. I'm really not concerned for the majority of the Omaha Metro. Temperatures on the cold side, upper 20s and low 30s, wind chills in the upper teens and low 20s for some, but it's really western Iowa with those very, very low visibilities and the chilly temperatures where there could be some slick bridges and overpasses. So you want to slow down not only for the low visibilities, but also because it could be a little slick out there. And same goes from Lincoln toward York along I-80. Low clouds, they win today. South winds could be gusting up to 15 or 20 miles an hour by noon. Temperatures in the low to mid 40s. We still have south winds. We still have clouds. We're still going to be cool this afternoon. Mid to upper 40s for our high temperatures. And then this evening could have a little drizzle from time to time, but I think mainly just low clouds through 10 o'clock. Steady temperatures overnight still in the mid 40s by 10 o'clock, and that's where we start tomorrow morning. Isolated drizzle and fog once again early Tuesday, and we still have the clouds around tomorrow afternoon. You can see the clearing coming into our northwest. It doesn't make it across Omaha and into western Iowa until Wednesday. So a couple of gray days coming up. We at least warm into the upper 50s tomorrow. 55 on Wednesday and then a bigger storm system comes in Thursday into Friday with a little bit of light rain and only rain, but a big drop in temperatures. Highs in the mid to upper 40s this weekend.